Hi, this is Krishna from Digital Graphic Designer YouTube channel. Today, we are going to learn that how to convert this image into comic book drawing in Photoshop. So, without wasting a time, let's get started. First of all, open the image into Photoshop and convert the image into smart object. And for that, Go to layers panel, right mouse click on layer and then choose convert to smart object. By converting this layer into smart object, we can work non-destructively. We can make changes to the filters that we will apply to this layer. Now create a copy of this layer and for that press ctrl plus j or command plus j from the keyboard. Rename this duplicate layer as outline and hide the original layer. We are going to work on the outline layer now. Now we need to create a black outline and we found this under the filters menu. So go to the filters menu and then choose filter gallery. In the filter gallery choose artistic folder and then choose poster edges. You can see three sliders here. First is edge thickness. It controls the thickness of the outline. Set it to zero. Now second slider is the edge intensity. It controls the darkness of the outline. Set the edge intensity two points and then the third slider is the posterization. It controls the color in the image. Set the value at 2. Then hit OK. In the next step, we are going to keep the black in the image and remove everything else. And we can do this by using adjustment called threshold. And for that, go to the image menu, then choose adjustments and then click on threshold. Threshold window will pop up. By default, the threshold value is set to 128 point. It means that any value higher than 128 will become black and the value lower than 128 will become white. Now we are going to adjust the threshold value as per the image that we could able to see the black outlines only and for that we set the threshold value at 7 points and then hit OK. Now when you zoom in the image, you can see the image with black outlines and white background that exactly what we want but you can also notice the outlines look very harsh and sharp and this does not look good so what can we do now we are now going to use filter that will help us to convert this image into smooth handmade comic book painting and for that go to filter menu and then go to the stylize and then choose oil paint this filter converts outline into smooth stroke that looks like a hand drawn. Make sure that lightning is off because lightning creates effect of actual paint on canvas that looks height and depth in the image that we do not want now for this effect. We are going to work on stylization and cleanliness only in this filter. So come to the stylization slider. Set the stylization value at 2.0 and the cleanliness value to 1.0. Keep the other values same and then hit OK. Now this image looks like a line we are now going to work with color that we will use for this comic book drawing effect. Now hide the outline layer and visible the original layer. Then create another copy of this original layer. For that press Ctrl plus J or Command plus J from the keyboard. Now rename this copy layer as color. Now with the color layer selected, go to the filter menu and choose filter gallery. Under the artistic group, choose poster edges again. We use the same filter to create colors that we used before. Set the edge thickness value to 0. Set the edge intensity value to 0. Keep the posterization value as it is. This will remove the edges and keep the color of the image that exactly what we want and then hit OK. Now with the color layer selected, go to the filter menu and then choose stylize and then choose oil paint. Keep the values same we set before and then hit OK. Now go to the layers panel and visible the outline layer. Then with the outline layer selected, go to the blending mode drop down and then choose multiply. You can see now the white pixels were gone and it will keep the black outline. Now if you want to adjust any effect you can do by double click 
on the filters given below to the layers you can adjust or change the setting of the filter if needed because we are working with the smart object and it is the biggest benefit to work with the smart object now double click on the thumbnail of any smart object in layers panel it will open the image in another document now if you apply any effect or filter on this image like labels or curves or you can make any changes here the changes will be shown automatically to the original document now we need to enhance our comic book drawing and for that we are going to work with colors now with the color layer selected go to the layers panel and click on adjustment layer icon and then choose levels the levels property panel will pop up adjust the levels and middle slider to adjust the contrast of the comic book drawing then again go to the adjustment layer icon and choose vibrance adjust the vibrance vibrance is the smartest way to saturating the colors of image vibrance adjustment layer protects already saturated pixels and skin tones now we can use it as a template and let us show you that how you can use this as a template select all layers excepting the original layer with holding shift key from the keyboard and press control plus g or command plus g from the keyboard to group them all now double click on the thumbnail of the original image this will open in another document because it is a smart object now import any other image to the layers panel if needed rescale it and then press control plus s or command plus s from the keyboard to save the document come back to the original document you can see the changes here the comic book drawing is updated and also you can come back to the group and edit all layers according to the image we replaced and change the values according to the new image if you want all the settings are up to you and the image you are working with now you can see the original image with look like comic book drawing enjoy your comic book drawing effect thank you so friends if you like the video please like the video comment and please subscribe our channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to get notified with our latest videos and for more tutorials visit our website pixeldesign.com thank you